Hey everyone, I uh, first and foremost want to take a moment and thank you for stopping by and I just want to get right to it. Do you ever find yourself just emotionally so stifled? Like there are a lot of things you've got to get done and no matter how you try and focus on them, do them, you can't stop ruminating or thinking about something or someone that's upset you. And we all go through moments like that. And the challenging thing is the more we try and push through, the less productive we are. And I always love to share with you books that are dramatically impacting my life. I'm an avid reader. I usually read about four books a month. I know some of you are like, how do you have the time to do that? I either am audio listening, I'm reading, I take books with me everywhere, and that's how I get it done. But the one of the most impactful books I've read lately is this one, The Clarity Cleanse. And in this book, there is a profound exercise that I just wanted to contribute to you. And I don't know if this is gonna to touch one of you or a thousand of you. Um, whatever it is you're going through, this is something you can do that's free, that's easy. And it's something I've been doing myself and I just finished day two today and there's five days of the exercise and I thought I have got to share it with all of you. So very simply, you take some paper and you set your timer for 12 minutes and for 12 minutes you write and you just purge everything that's in your heart that's in your head anything that you want to let go of writing from a place and it might even sound like you're you know a five-year-old having a temper tantrum whatever's upsetting you and just writing and writing and writing and the thing I'll tell you is after today doing this exercise, I, I just couldn't believe some of the things that were coming up for me and some of the things, even as someone who trains personal empowerment, I know that you love for us, your personal empowerment trainers to be so perfect. We're not, not one of us is. I think in order to teach the work, you have to do the work and I'm constantly doing the work but I found for myself as a, a trainer and someone who's done you know, NLP training and so many different exercises and trained exercises, I was actually shocked at some of the stuff that was still coming up for me. And so after this 12 minutes of writing, you don't read it, you take the paper and you burn it. There's something so cleansing about the fire. So it's a very simple exercise. You do it for five days. And if you're holding on to something or you're feeling stuck in your life, I just invite you you to give this a try. I know some of you are going for great goals in your life and you're pushing, you're pushing, you're pushing, but you're feeling so stuck. The, you know, the great thing is about this exercise, it allows you to emotionally purge. And when we do that, it's like I teach my organizer life students that when we create a clearing in anything, whether we clear out our garage, we suddenly, you know, we'll fill it up again, or we clear out a junk drawer, it gets filled again. The same thing that's true with holding on to negative toxic emotions in our body. When we purge them out of our body, it makes room for all sorts of goodness and love and abundance to flow. So with that, I just wanted to share it's something really helping me. I love you guys. I just, you know, post in this thread comment. I read all of your comments. If this is something you're willing to undertake or if you have already started, I'd love to hear that too. So with that, God bless. Go rock your day and I will see you next time.